Yo guys, it's Palancos here with Elemental Design, and today I am here with my tutorial. So basically, um, Vivid asked me if I could show him how I did the sound bars in the previous video. So that's what I'm gonna do today. Okay, so here we are in After Effects. I don't know, you can do it in After Effects CS6 and CS5, I'm not sure. You just have to see. Okay, so let's start. Let's go to Composition. New Composition, this doesn't really matter that much. Let's make it 1920 by 180. 180. And call it whatever you want, I'll just call it main code. Okay, and we want it fans and this all of this, so just click OK. Now first of all you wanna get the background image. Okay now I'm using an image I made for proximity and they are a channel and they make um, like these videos also. And here we go, I made this one for them. Okay, so let's start. There we go. Now what you wanna go to effects and presets tab here. And if it doesn't show up for you, maybe here. This what it may be for you then go here or and check that effects and presets in the end in the window if it doesn't show up. I'm just sure to go. Okay, so let's go to there. Here. And click like it was audio. And there are two types of audio things. There's spectrum and waveform. But now don't put it on here because they'll delete the image. So what we'll do is layer kneel solid call this um, uh, it doesn't matter um, what color just click ok and now click the audio script on it so now we have it if we play it nothing happens so now we have to add the music and let's see I use song I use in my video okay Okay, 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 let's go over time. And let's go control over here. And just click and drag it over here. Now go back to effect controls. Make sure you've got sound bar selected. And click here on the audio layer. Make sure yeah, that's over time. And so now, you will see what it's going Hold on. Now you can see. But if I just see that, if I have waveform, it will give this kind of effect. So and that's not what I want. So let's put it again. Okay. Over time. Okay. So now, first, what you want to do is click the first little round button here to that side, and the other one to that side. And your inside color, let's just make it a bluish. And the outside color, let's see if it, oh, if the wagon looks good. And let's go to maximum height and just make that bigger. I will just there to black and the other one to white okay and now to thickness make it a bit thicker okay so now what you have is this thing it all looks good but it should be round so you want to do is go to here to effects and presets again 
and go to Pola and click that one and put it on the sound bath again and now what you want to do is change rec to polar and put it all the way to 100 percent so now we have this round thing but it's kind of small so we want to change that Now the way we do that is first click on the sound bar, then click S, they will put the scale thing up. Now just drag it up till you like it. So now what we still have is it goes still it still goes to the inside. So we'll change that by side options side B and now we have this now you can change all of this where it starts where it ends probably how many there are from those just like this like you just have to find what match for you and the next one hi Yes, you, you have to do it um, personally. I can't tell you how to do it because some people like it like big and so small. It's all very different. So just do what you want. Let's see. Let's make it so you can see. That. There, there we go. So and that's basically it. It's, it's actually very easy. And that's it. You can change all of this the softness. Can't see that much. If you look closer now, get softer. And all of that. You can change all of it. Even the scale. And if you want, you can have it the other way around. But I just like to have it be. And uh, there's this, just play around with it, but basically I like to do it like this. And so now you have got it in After Effects, but not as a video. So if you don't know how to do it, just go to Composition, Add to Render Cube. Go to this. And the only thing you will need to change is this here just click on it and I'll just change it to whatever you will just tutorial and where you want it just click save and if you're ready then click render and this will render the whole video and then you'll have it in your your folder you chose so that was it for today guys I hope you liked it Please leave a rating, a comment, and if you enjoyed it, please subscribe. It really means a lot to me. So guys, bye. See you next time.